This LGBT STEM day, we ask people what kind of changes they'd like to see in science, technology, engineering and maths. What changes would I like to see in STEM? I would like to see us get to the point, first of all, where LGBTQ people are treated equally and fairly in STEM careers. Hi, I'm Anna, and I want to see more diversity and more representation. To have a look at diverse hiring practices that allow people to celebrate their queerness together with their scientific work. I would like people in STEM to take an evidence-based approach towards gender and sexuality. I would like to see STEM organisations be more proactive and visible about their support for the LGBTI community. And then I'd like to see us move right past that to a point where LGBTQ perspectives and insights are really valued as part of the scientific process. I want LGBT professionals to be able to be out at work without feeling shame. I want to see more people of colour and more religious minorities in STEM fields without experiencing discrimination. The LGBTI community can often be invisible because we have to be vocal and come out in order for people to know about us. So coming into the construction industry, I didn't really have any LGBTI role models to look up to. The biggest change that I would like to see in STEM is that everyone should feel welcome. Nobody should feel uncomfortable, excluded or alienated based on characteristics such as race, sex, gender, sexual orientation. I wish that LGBTQ plus people are seen in the curriculum and the culture and are encouraged to be out and are affirmed by their strengths and contributions and not just quietly tolerated. I'd like to have a look at the types of research we conduct. Are they about the community and without us or are they actually led for the benefit of queer people? I'd like to see a greater understanding by the cis straight majority working in STEM of the issues faced by LGBTQ people. In technology, it's a very male-dominated area. I'd like to see some more gender diversity in this area. I want people of all backgrounds, everyone, to feel that they belong in the academic world, because they do. I would like to see more senior people who represent me in science and engineering. Currently, there are very few out trans men senior scientists, making it hard for me to feel like it's a place I belong and can contribute. Nothing should make somebody feel unwelcome in science, in technology, engineering, mathematics. Acknowledge that there is no scientific justification for homophobia or transphobia. I think it's really important that when an LGBTQ person raises an issue, it's listened to, understood and addressed rather than dismissed or denied. We can and should do a lot more for trans and non-binary people in STEM and elsewhere. Allies who are not part of oppressed groups stepping up and standing up for people who are in oppressed groups. We can start with very small steps, like asking people what their pronouns are and try to respect them and stick to them. You can put your pronouns at the bottom of your emails so everybody can see them. I'd like to make the case for trade unions that really represent the interests of the LGBT STEM community. So trade unions exist to stand by workers who experience discrimination and unfair treatment and we have the tools to do that well. But what we also need is your lived experience to inform the work that we do. I feel like when it's very male dominated you get a lot of toxic masculinity which can make it hard for LGBT plus folk. So I feel like if you focus on trying to make more gender diversity you could make the whole environment a lot better and recognise that seemingly trivial assumptions at both personal and institutional levels can have significant impacts on the lives of LGBTQIA people. In addition, I think there is still an awful lot of work still to do on intersectionality and transgender and non-binary characteristics for those people working in STEM. So celebrate this LGBT STEM day by joining a trade union and then get active and make it your union and you can make sure in your demographic forms you uh, provide a third option as a gender and gender neutral titles and make your restrooms gender neutral. If organisations are more visible about their support for the community, then LGBTI individuals would feel more comfortable about coming out in the workplace and this would encourage others to pursue or progress a career within the STEM industry. Everyone should feel free to live their identity openly and happily. And I'd like more validation for queer and trans people of colour. 
I want to see that STEM subjects are for everybody, regardless of gender or sexuality, and that diversity can produce better results. <laughs>